Hello everybody and welcome to episode 5 of Guardians of the Galaxy. I am back where I have left off. Slimy. Yeah, you guys have probably uh, seen this bit at least like three times in you might the last come down episode. Here. Oh, why the fuck is so deep? In a jam, boys? I think, you think I now know what I have to do. Smack, reach! Sword will not work, woman. Find us a rope. Yeah, it fast. Where am I supposed to find a rope? I don't know. I'm sinking in jelly here. Well, do something! Like what? Yeah, I'm ready. Well. I press one button, and then I press the other button, and then it did nothing. Wait! Before when I was a kid, I don't do it on purpose. Classic Spartoi tech. Just when you think you've seen it all, you pull scut like this. Just do. Please, the guns let me, alone. Let me, I, well, I just want to see how they tick. Otherwise, it might as well be magic or sorcery. Guys. Yeah, there's a doll right there. Sorcery. Here we go again. Oh, and you know, there's more jelly. Climb up and over. Ding, ding, ding! Give that man a gold star. Barely any power. Maybe we can muscle those can Drax, think you can drag this cannon out? Okay. I will try. Okay. I believe you. It is more stubborn than expected. I'm not lacking. Ah, impossible. It will not stay in place. You couldn't just hold Drax. Can you try again? Why? It does not stay. I'm working it out. Trust me. I... I cannot... Hold that in it! Impressive, Peter Quill. Now we gotta get the next one out. Yeah, if I never see another one of these ships again, it'll be too soon. On that alone, we are agreed. Am I Rocket, I need you to squeeze inside that little hole and try to knock the gun loose from the inside. Hello, Shatari ship, full of booby traps and death mechanisms. But you love both those things. Uh... You're right, I do. And I always wanted to see the inside of one of these bug bombs. But... Oh, what reeks in here? 
here. That. Oh, Scott. Ah, ah. You okay in the rocket? I found the crew. I guess not even the worms want to eat that Shatari meat. Rocket. Relax. Just gonna reroute the little bit of remaining power to the cannon and. Nothing. You know what, Clark? It. I'm blowing it up. What? Hang on. Think about all the booby traps and. Rocky, you okay? <laughs> yeah, and dry now, too. Mora, can you clear us a path through that junk? Sure. Yes, Peter Quill. Onward to the palace of the great giantess. That's us. Oh. oh. That is not a happy monster. Well, at least it left. Back to its brood mother, Lady Hellbender. Come on. Why is the bridge always on the wrong side? This time I insist we hurl the foul beast. And I insist we push muscles over the side of the cliff. To what end? Yours! You are dead! How yeah, many we're not times dying. do I have to say I'm it? Not, we're not I'm throwing not. rocket. Ridiculous. You were holding us back to spare the beast's feelings. When has he done the same for us? Put him down. Let's be a lesson to you. Oh, I'll show you what a lesson looks like! Knock it off, guys! We're supposed to be professionals. We're better than this. I'm not. Letting a Beasley Chitauri installation stop our progress is unprofessional. And stop wasting time arguing. We'll find another way across. Huh, I already see. Our entry point. Or exit point. I used to believe that the rodent had the most impressive firearm in our group. Cracks, caves, or crevices, people. I feel like I've heard you say that before, but in a different context. The fortress is this way, if you will. I know, I'm just doing some exploring. Oh, uh cool. -huh. done enough of that already? I'm pretty sure exploring is code. It means he went the wrong way, but it's too stubborn to admit it. You know, turn the water into an ice is pretty chill. He says the soil here is like super dark with plants. I think I can see my house from here. What are you doing up there? Scout type stuff. Scouting. Looks like we uh need to keep going towards the fortress and not away from it. Excellent work, Peter. You know, you guys could take my ideas more seriously. I do have augmented. What is 55,787,880 divided by 9,512? 5,863, give or take. I got a glitchy calculator tip that's always on. What is 4 okay, plus 2? Right. Four. <laughs> what is two plus four? Eight. <laughs> and he's our engineer. Well, he might be our engineer. You'll never know. Someone else might take his spot. Shouldn't we at least have a leash for our monster? There's usually some acting involved in this kind of infiltration. Guys, I've got something here. No, don't worry about it. It's Who deep. needs acting? This looks promising. Well, Who no needs a leash when you have acting? We're not gonna be here long. Anybody see a way through? We'll make one if we have to. Oh, anybody else smell that? It really stinks back here. Yes, it smells putrid. Ugh. Where is it coming from? Oh, what the flark! Not talking. Not even breathing. Yeah, I know we have to do we need to use so. I think the smell's coming from that wall here. Yep. Definitely something gross behind here. Go. Drax. Can you chuck that through the stink wall? Yay! Uh, that pissed 
Disturbingly fragrant. I am clenching every orifice right now. Oh, okay, what's this that's thing? Kind of weird. Hello? Anybody? I feel like it's got a button. It might explode. I wouldn't touch it. Oh, oh no! Okay, that got my <clears throat> blood pumping. Yeah. Old lady hellbender cage this creature. Because uh, it's annoying as scud. Perhaps it is food. That thing's food? Yes, monster food. I wonder what it tastes like. Peter. Why would it taste like that? I can use this. You know, we really got monster gotta food. Your taste, the cage. You get it? We need the cage. Taste we go into that fortress with our with our monster peacefully walking beside us. We'll be laughed right out of the room. Any bites? Why are you whispering? Two more thinks we can sell our monster act better if we have a proper cage. Only problem is, there's a pissed off monster inside. Release the beast, let me dispose of it, because that worked so well for you last time. We need a better plan of attack. Yes. Ideally, one that guarantees my safety is leader. Release the beast. Please don't attack us with Fuji. You're welcome. Stumpy's back! Oh. Throw that Drax! I meant to hit the other one, but Keep that's moving. fine. Ow. Stinky crawl spaces, and now all these monsters. I hate this flarking planet. You hate everything, Rocket. Stinky slime tunnel park. <laughs> Deep freeze. Whoa! Can I try ice cubing something? Nope. Man, you're such a gas flat. Okay, then. Man. So if we're gonna haggle with the monster queen, how much are we asking for our monster? Three hundred ninety-five million units, give or take two. One for every precious hair follicle on this flawless body. You have counted them. That is bizarre. Hey, at least I have some to count. Uh, uh, Group, give me a bridge here. The fortress is right on the other side of those cliffs. Uh, Pretty sure it's this way, but I don't see an easy way to get up there. Easy is rarely worth it. Yeah. For you, maybe. I love easy. Thank you. No, it ain't. What did the tree say? 
He says all this moisture is good for us and will make us grow. In your case, that is doubtful. I agree with Groot. It's important to stay hydrated. This mm. hydrated. It is good to stay hydrated. Whoa, that is definitely But I don't think we need seats. to be drowned by it. What's that thingy down there? Oh. What the fuck? You said that quarantine zone monster was supposed to be rare. She already has a whole herd of them? Yeah, but like, so we wasted our time. Almost got killed for nothing. And got arrested. That was fun. It was moderately amusing. Now we've got a ticking time bomb on the ship. Guys, every misstep was just a step in the right direction towards completing our best plan yet. Say that again? What if we brought one of those ugly suckers all the way here only to find out Lady H already had a full set? That would have sucked big time. Exactly. Well, let's just get this done. I thought we were about to be run over. Oh, hoverboard over? You can't be serious. Okay. It's farther than it looked. Much farther. It's a flarkin' infinity bridge, is what it is. Are uh, you being dramatic, Rodent? The bridge ends at the fortress, therefore it is not infinite. Yeah, that's super comforting. Guess we gotta go. In silence. Peter? Aren't you forgetting something? Are you Groot? Oh! Right! The cage. The point of even getting the Flarkin thing is looking like we mean business. Alright, Rocket. Time to put on your monster face. I only got one face, Quill. Are you sure about this, Peter? <laughs> Look at him! You better have one hell of a sales pitch. Remind me again. How many missions have we been on so far? Thirteen. Fourteen, if you count contracts. Contracts, yeah, it was not a mission. It was a mistake. All right. Point is, is I was able to sell you. Gamora, daughter of Thanos, intergalactic assassin. As a hero. Fourteen times! <laughs> Fine. I think he's made his point. Drat. Gamora, can you help me with this? No. What? Why? To guarantee your safety as a leader. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> She's got you there, Quill. Now shut up and start pulling. Can you stop worrying so much? You're gonna start growing knots again. Okay, here we go. Might take a while. Whoa! <laughs> okay, whoa, whoa! A little bit close. They seem so peaceful here. Never saw a real well when I was a kid. I guess this sort of counts. I'm sure it's real pretty, but can we not draw its attention while I'm stuck in a flarkin cage, please? Yeah, that's fair enough. Oh! I'm gonna come, I keep holding the lead. Anybody have like a campfire song or something we could sing to kill the time? Ooh, ooh, I know one. It's called. Please stop. All right, yeah. Okay. Wait, is please stop the name of your song? No. Okay. As long as it's not copyrighted. So, how long before someone else wants to pull this thing? We are 60 clicks from the fortress. I'd say closer to 75. Well, there is only one way to know for sure. 0 0.1 clicks. 0 0.2 clicks. 0 0.9. 2.1. 0.3 oh, clicks. Hey, 4. Buddy. 5. 0 0.4 clicks. 0 0.5 clicks. 0 0.6 clicks. Stop counting clicks. We could take turns to I don't know what's happening. Star Lord. The guy with the scary eyes. If you don't hurry, I'm gonna eat that whole cake myself. Yeah, um. 
Don't know what that was all about. Uh, you Thirteen know. whole years. Look at you. Where does time go? I'll be up in a sec. I promise. Right. It's a flashback. <laughs> Give me a sec. I didn't think you'd actually come up. Maybe being on time is my new thing. Oh, right. We'll see about that when I have to get you up for school tomorrow. You know, I think I'm too old for that, too. Nice try, smart Alec. Sit. Don't worry, I'm not gonna sing. I like your singing. Well, you might be the only one. Go on, make a wish. You're officially a teenager. Look at all those girlfriends. Someone's gonna be really popular at school. Mom. What? You are very handsome. I'm sure all the girls are gonna be falling off. Mom. Home. What did you wish for? Why would I wish for anything? I've got everything I want. <laughs> oh, what huge favor are you about to ask me? Just 10 bucks. Dan, Andy, and I wanna go see Night of the Cosmos at the Rio tonight. A movie. Tonight. Come on. You know, I it's did, gonna be sick. I did actually it's about these zombies night. that invade Earth, and then it's up to these kids that have to blow them away. You know. I don't think I'd want you to see that, Peter. I let you watch the hockey mask one and you were sleeping in my bed the next three nights. That was ages ago. And this one isn't even that bad. It's PG thirteen. And I'm 13. Exactly. PG-13 may contain violence and nudity. Mild nudity, like butts and stuff. You're not helping your case. No, I just, I, I wanted us to have some us time tonight, you know? Maybe finish our game. You can't duck out right when I'm about to win. Okay, it's not that. It's it's opening night, and it's my birthday, you know? It was meant to be. Meant to be, huh? Pretty please? I don't know. Truck's still in the shop, and I don't want you walking alone in the dark. There's been a lot of weirdos out there. It's not safe. I'll be careful, Ma. I always am. Were you careful when you got that black eye? I told you I, I was- I know! You were standing up for someone, which is a good thing. But you cannot go punching your way out of every problem, Peter. I couldn't just stand there. No. What the heck's wrong with the candles? Of course not. Okay, get me my purse. Not so fast. Before you go, there's something I want to talk to you about. Something I want to give you. Twenty bucks? Don't push it. Think of it as a long overdue gift from your father. It's upstairs on my bed. Go on and get it while I finish up in the kitchen. And we can open it together. Yeah, um... They have a dog. Hello, doggy. Hey, Kubrick, buddy. No matter how long you wait here for Grandma and Grandpa, they're not coming back. Sorry. I know the real reason you don't want to finish our game. You're just scared that I'll beat you. I still have lots of time to stage a comeback. Sometimes Grandma and Grandpa would let me sleep with them if I was too afraid down in the basement. Man, am I glad I finally got my hair the way I like it. 
think I'm in the wrong one. Yeah, that's okay. I miss them so much. Grandma used to take me into town on Sundays to run errands. We'd stop for ice cream on the way home. I Even feel very bad for that dog. Didn't you say open it last? Yeah. Or not? Okay, that's fine. At its entrance, anyway. So, as I was saying, I can handle a little solo extraction. No offense, but you ain't exactly invested in my safe return. My skin, my plan. Your call, Peter. The bark it is. I'm the one in the box, lady. Peter Quill is our leader. The burden of your possible death falls on his shoulders. Fully on board with Rocket's plan that I was totally paying attention to. See? Even Captain Space Cadet don't trust your gymnastics. Look what Wait, got what about coming. gymnastics? I just think we shouldn't be relying on a piece of tech you won't even just be around to use. To find it out. Has neutrino splicing. It's a tracker. Even you mouth breathers could figure it out. Name. Guardians of the Galaxy. Never heard of you. I'm Groot. Bonafide monster sellers. Today, anyway. What's in the box? A monstrous abomination from Halfworld and the meanest SOB in the Quadrant. Pass. Pass? Rocket! I mean, Things puny. It is a hell beast, the namesake of your mistress. It would be wise to reconsider. All right, get going before I change my mind. And if the lady don't like it, I'll be carting out what's left of you in that box. Hell beast? It is an accurate moniker. The little beast has a hellish demeanor. I like it. This place is a lot bigger. Not than exactly I an easy way out if this all goes to hell. It's gonna go great. We got a killer monster and a solid plan. I would show more caution, Peter Quill. If Lady Hellbender realizes our deceit, her vengeance will be swift. What? I'm supposed to be scared just because she's got hell in her name? She runs a glorified zoo. That's no zoo. The monster queen has a monster army. Any chance of the zookeepers with guns? I have never seen one of those two. But I have seen one trample a man to pulp. It's fine. Worst comes to worst, we hightail it for the Milano. Your genius plan is run away? Backup plan? Which we're not gonna need, but yeah. It's not like she can chase after us with her old monster mash. <clears throat> oh, come on. Why did we not simply dock here and avoid the police and hospital surface? Because Quill flies like a one-eyed badoon. We needed time to iron out the plan. Now it's foolproof. Lady Hellbender is no fool. When her monster goes missing, she'll assume it was us. Assume, yes, but not no. Not chases across the galaxy level of no, at least. Wow. Look at this place. I'm in the wrong line of work. It is appropriately impressive for a warrior of Lady Hellbender's stature. This is kind of thing. Ha! <laughs> Not yours. Come over near the cave and say that again. Focus, guys. Time to get those game faces on. I am Groot. He means you gotta sell the illusion, too. Exactly. Laren skull. That is truly a priceless trophy. Behold. Explained the vault. Priceless? Vault? Screw the sneaking around. Let's pull off a good, honest heist. No! no! Follow me and pay attention. You will not approach Lady Hellbender's throne. If she chooses to approach you, you will remain still. No erratic movements. I am a noble, and my king's confidence is very empty. Apologies, my queen. I meant no offense. I know what you meant. Do not blame me for You are not the first to claim they have captured a Tara Tara. You, you doubt its authenticity? If it is what you say it is, prove it. Or suffer the consequence of every other would-be con artist. I, 
assure you, I said, Milady. release it. We got this. Question how we're gonna make that. Bring in the next seller and transfer 10,000 units to that last one's next of it. Speak. Hey there, I'm Star Lord. Okay. Drax the Destroyer. The undoing of the Mad Titan in the flesh. And such flesh. <laughs> Your presence honors me. You are much smaller than I expected. Oh? And what were you expecting? Perhaps I can do something about it. But uh, unlikely. We'll see, Destroyer. I can be quite forceful. Peter Quill. I believe she is flirting with me. Flatter her or something. You got this. This for the best. Your negotiation skills are terrible. Lady Hellbender, I can see by the size of your weapon that you must be a skillful warrior. Hmm. Perhaps I can give you a demonstration sometime. You would make an acceptable opponent. Tell me, Destroyer, what brings you to Sagnarf 9? Peter Quill, show her the creature. It's big size. Yeah, I wouldn't pet him like that again unless you want to lose a finger. He bites hard. I admire a creature with some spirit. What would you call it? It is a hell beast. It doesn't look like much. <sighs> if I didn't know any better. I'd think it was a woodland creature. True, but do we mention it's one of a kind? Just look deep into those angry raccoon eyes. I ain't a freaking raccoon! And you'll see that there's a monster in there. Big, scary, trigger And what would you like for the... Hell Beast? 
20,000 units. Twenty thousand. And not a penny less. Twenty thousand? Uh, wow, okay. See, I was thinking more like... Twelve? No. Nine, then. Uh, the creature is worthless to me. <sighs> I would rather buy the Flora Colossus. Told you. What? You want to buy Groot? Is he for sale? No, he ain't. Just think of the money, Rocket. I am Quill. And Groot's not for sale. Ah! 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 What are you doing? Plan B, Quill. Guys, less talking, more escaping. Uh. <laughs> I was not expecting that. I'm just like, ah, oh, she'll probably just buy it, you know. Bring it on, punk! Try and get out of here in one piece. We ain't done yet. Excuse me? I came here for units, and I ain't leaving without <laughs> Yup, we're gonna clean out that vault we saw on the way out. Can I take a screenshot of that? I might need You can't one. be serious. Even Peter's not that suicidal. You wanna cut and run, or do you wanna get paid? We don't have time to argue. Hellbender's goons are gonna be here any second. Quill's right. Shut your traps and follow me. Not what I'm saying. Let's just find the big elevator we came in on and get the hell out. No wonder we're always poor. We got company! About time! These guys don't waste any time popping out of me, guy! There goes any repeat business! I ain't taking orders from that skull suit anyway! Nice work, Peter! I can't tell if that was. Like, Lady Hilden is just getting her affections in a contested oh. manner. This no. guy gets hit on once, and it goes right through his head! I'm not, I'm not sure if she was sarcastic or not. Nice work, Peter! Perhaps Nova Corps will accept the rodent as a down payment! Let's just worry about getting out of here! We're headed the right way! Maybe. Yeah. Your assurances mean nothing, Rodent. Yeah, uh, where are we going? Oh. Yeah. Huh? So she's pissed off. The right, first. Cross it. <laughs> Another Hellraiser defeated. Incoming attack. Survival. Wait. You don't stand a 
Once we get through this bit, I'll call it an episode. Okay, um... Yeah. We got company! Last time I checked, the galaxy does not have a corner. So she's pissed off. The uh oh. These guys don't waste any time. I'll be sure to kill them quick. Uh oh. Not much weight to pull. Joke all you want, but without me, you wouldn't be able to get through this door. Without you, we wouldn't be in front of this door. Oh, well, you're right for lies. You see? Vault's right there. We smash and grab, then, like Will said, out the way we came. 5,000 units to the Hellraiser who kills the so called guardians of the galaxy. Okay, people, let's do this. One catastrophe at a time. No big drugs! Ha ha ha! Too bad Rocket isn't! This vault better be the mother of all payloads! I'd sell for our lives and enough to pay the fine! No thanks. I I I would prefer to keep my head. Ha! Gus minions? Where's these famous monsters? You couldn't hold it together just a little longer, Rocket. Next time, try biting your tongue, Rocket. Nobody crossed me. I would have done any different. Okay, so we gotta shoot our way into the box. Big deal! <laughs> Her vault is gonna be stronger than her convictions. I'll tell your mistress to say goodbye. The assassins 
You can't run forever, Guardians. Uh. I'm telling you, we can still come out on top of this thing. Ark! Way too close. Follow them. We should keep moving. We are moving. Ah! Uh, guys, I think we walked right into a trap. Trap? No, she said trap. Everyone look for a way out. Uh, Quickly! Down. Murderous eyes, return. Try to. The floor's weaker here, and it looks like there's a tunnel or something below us. You carve us a hole, Gamora. Flattered, but no chance. This has got Destroyer written all over it. Shall reduce it to rubble. You expect us to crawl through a sewer? I ain't getting wet again! I don't want to hear one word out of you! You all got a real funny way of saying thanks. Gratitude is not my current sentiment. All right, nobody's perfect. Some of us served a mad titan, and some went a little nuts hunting him down. And some of us get a little touchy being called worthless. You are not worthless, Rocket. But he's clearly worth less to Hellbender. She says she would have bought Groot. Groot ain't some piece of lumber you can hawk. Though I'm sure you got plenty experience trafficking lies. Watch your tongue, or I'll cut it out. That's right. Everybody quiet! Come on! We'll cut them off at the vault. Why does he sound like Omer? Not even joking, he kinda sounded like Omer. Perfect. It does yeah. not seem perfect. It means we're headed the right way! Straight into an ambush! Just another by the numbers plan for Guardians of the Galaxy. What we should have done is sold Drax. Hellbender was practically begging to buy a night with a big gold. Well, take a deep breath, cause we're here. One vault as promised. And a giant locked door. Heads up! Ambush! Yeah! We're ambushing them! And they're gonna die. Oh, sucker! Suck on this! Yeah! Tell him, well! It's not a nightmare. We are clearly awake. Keep the breathing room, Groot. Throw that tracks. This reminds me of the Sakaran battle arena. Whatever you gotta tell yourself. I expected more from someone who saved the Hellbender. Oh, man, you laid that space nerd out! Love it, Adam, big guy! This one is primed for punishment! Keep the head careful! Ow. This is exactly why we should have gone with Bruce! Not my best choice, I get it! Side of Xandar, I can't pop. I am adding to your debt for every extra minute this takes. Keep your manis on. You can't rush the genius. All Hellraisers to the main vault. Or I could try rushing and hope for the best. Alright, uh, guys. I did not teleport here. Huh? My blades grow weary. My patience grows weary. Get back to 
for an ETA. plan is to get all the small little ones, small annoying ones, and then find the big one. Be back into a corner if it's around. Past time someone got stabbed. It doesn't really make that much sense. If you run away, you might have lived. And pop. There we go. Then close enough. Move your asses while you still got him. <laughs> See? Nothing. You! Gamora, no killing teammates. That's who? It's literally in your contract. I made no such commitment. He's a liability, Peter. Ha! Coming from the most wanted woman in the galaxy. Most Same thing. How about a thank you, Rocket? For nearly getting us killed? <sighs> for getting us into... The crappiest vault in the greater Magellanic Cloud? You said there'd be treasure! A Galeran skull is priceless. Worthless is not the same. Guys! We need a plan! Agreed! My arms are growing moderately fatigued. Dig deep, Drax. Gamora, cover him. Rock and I will try to find something of value. Groot! Don't break anything! It's gotta be more than just junk and scabby. Well, this is not nothing, but nowhere near what we owe. Units are like fermites. If she keeps any in here, there's gotta be more. Here we go. Not quite enough, but we're getting there. That's what I'm talking about. Not such a bad plan, after all. Not exactly good either. Don't mind if I do oh, steal. All right, this will cover our fine at least. Why stop there? After all she put us through, I say we clean her out. What she put us through? Enough! Huh? Peter Quill. It's grown quiet. Quiet like peace and quiet, or like the grave sort of quiet? Definitely mm. the grave one. 
Drax, please tell me you didn't just lock us in. I did not do anything. I'm almost impressed. The woodland creature has more bite than I originally perceived. <laughs> Enjoy the contents of my vault, Guardians. They will be the last thing Peter. you ever see. Shame to waste my Clintarian gas on such unworthy do try not to melt all over my Kalaran skull. We need to find a way out. Now! It is both priceless and hard to please. These crap people! Anyone else feel burning? Like, all over? Clintarian gas breaks down organic material, leading to the pile of sludge-covered bones. So let's bust our way out of here while we still have the organs to do it! Behind this wall! Allow me! You're not getting through this with your bare hands! We need something heavy! Luke's right! One of them lights has gotta be plenty heavy! Aha! Uh -huh, found it! They ain't staying frozen, Quill. We gotta get out of here. Come on. Do your magic, group. What? He ain't doing it. Gamora, think you can cut loose one of those lights? Heads up! Well, um... Ah, now that was priceless. Throw it right through that wall! With all my might! That'll do her! Let's move, people! I hope you know what you're doing! That makes two of us! Is everyone okay? Let me escape. Gamora, Drax... I'll live. My epithelial layer is intact. Rocky, Groot, where are you? Does anyone see a way out? I see a bright light. Well, don't go towards it. Guardians of the galaxy, how many times do I have to kill you? Stall her, Peter. I haven't the killed us once. That you thought you could rob me. For the record, we weren't all on board with the plan. Thanks, Quill. Why not sell the clothes right off my back? Do you know what I did to the last people who thought I was easy prey? You let them go? I got nothing. We're trapped. Lady Hellbender, let us settle this honorably. I will face you in combat. Honorably? Your offer is worthless, Destroyer. There is no escaping my... I can work with that. Dweller! Feast upon them! Oh, it's him. Hey, buddy. Hey, dude. I remember you. You tried killing me! Uh, sir. Do 
a plate. Trying to get rocket. Okay, 
So, yeah, that's a lot longer of a recording than I was expecting, but yeah, I'm gonna call it there and we'll finish off the boss fight in the next episode. I hope you guys have enjoyed and I'll see you in the next episode. Goodbye.